you know, real health care to all and also to change the system. See, the system has to change from a system which is designed to administer to the sick right. to a system that's designed to promote wellness on the front end. Uh, and, 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 and it requires mindset changes that the doctor is not simply someone I go to see because I'm sick. The doctor is someone, it starts with having insurance and having access and having a doctor. There's a lot of issues, mm -hmm. but it starts, you know, and we have to, we have to, we have to uh, you know, educate and then create access and create. We need more doctors. Look, number of black male doctors is going down in America. Number of African American doctors is going down in America. We need doctors. We need nurses. We need nursing assistants. We need uh, 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 psychiatric aides. We need surgical technicians. We need uh, uh, physicians assistants. I mean, all these and these jobs in healthcare pay relatively good money. Relatively good money, not in every instance, but the so we need a generation yeah. that says that. You know, this pandemic is a wake-up call to health disparities. Health disparities are about quality of life. Health disparities are about our survival. And Absolutely. we can't say, pan, pan, pandemic's over. Rock, roll, get right back into the same old deal. Yeah. Right? We have to change. I told, uh, shared with a member of Congress yesterday, a member of the United States Senate, conversation I had, I said, look, you all are investing billions of dollars in the hospital system. Is that money going to be invested to create a hospital system that is tooled and retooled to help address health disparities, right? Yeah. This is not just about uh, building or putting Humpty Dumpty back on the wall the same way Humpty Dumpty was, or Humpty and Mary. Here, Humpty and Mary Dumpty. We have to build them back in a different way, in a better way. 